Welcome back to our Total War Room 2 Nossos campaign. First of all, sorry for not uploading for quite a while. I've been busy on my studies and I'll probably be going on hiatus for the next four weeks or so to focus on my examinations. So yeah, this slightly... <laughs> that was well timed. Uh, this slightly different from where we last left off because I wanted to click the end turn and get it done over with before I showed you guys the start of next turn but what happened is that Sardis uh, came over with some armies and said hey you wanna fight so sure thing we'll just send them to their graves earlier I'll see you guys on the battlefield so let's see our battlegrounds we are fighting uphill uh, let's just do the usual then hopefully our archers will turn the tide for us hmm We are up against a uh, army with low armor, so hopefully my Cretans will be able to prove their worth. We'll try to deploy them to the right with some cav guarding them, I guess. You guys will be to the left. We'll want to group our cav slightly separately, I guess. And let's see how this battle unfolds. Can't wait for the Emperor's edition though. I heard they're going to revamp the AI, Archers! which will be much interesting. At speed! I mean it will be of much interest. I've seen videos of it being uh, coming out already. Seems interesting. Can't wait for the new campaign though. At least it's free. In hindsight though, I feel like I've been playing a beta for an entire year or so. So, well, that's great. See how they're deployed. See skirmishers in front. Uh, there are levy hoplites behind. And yeah, the reinforcements are arriving though. Okay. Um. Sorry about that. Just give me a moment. Yes. Okay. Now let's proceed. Uh. Since they have care, we might want to draw. Uh, what should we do? Archers. Understood. Ready and waiting. We can either skirmish with them or just go all in. Uh, our inventory is far superior to theirs. Men, swords drawn and make ready. Uh, their reinforcements are slowly arriving though. It'll probably be to our advantage if we just rush them. Archers! As you Ooh, that's their reserve army. We gotta do this quickly. Okay. Okay, let's quickly, hopefully, swiftly take out their first army. Our general is under attack. Oh, come on. 
Perhaps pushing our archers up too early might have been a bad idea. Probably should have put them behind the infantry. Our infantry is clashing. Okay, what we need now is to just really organize our troops better. Looks like our archers are pouring some good flanking fire on these guys. Who already do not seem to be faring well. Okay, who's not fighting? These guys just need to reform. Okay, let's pull these guys back. What's our calf doing? This calf is currently fighting that unit. Oh come on, these units are caught in a crossfire. Looks like we're done taking out one or two units. Let's move our archers up and take on other units. Ready now. Let's do the one unit to eat them out. Understood. Hopefully, facing the back to Cretans will show you exactly why it's not a good idea. Ready for oh, oh, come on, how are they holding out this law? Uh, let's see now. Okay, let's pull our calf out. Okay, our early hoppers are being destroyed now. We gotta do something about this, let's see. Let's bring our archers to bear on this unit. Let's let the general inspire himself. Citizen Wait, let, let the citizen cap to drop off early first. Oh, come on, this is a mess. Okay, we're starting to seriously take down one or two units. Citizen cavalry. Hopefully this will help. Ready. Nice, we're beginning to take out one or two units. Then again we're outnumbered, so we need to hurry. What the hell is this unit doing? Looks like we're starting to crush their first army. Citizen cavalry! On if only due to the sheer quality difference between our units and theirs. Citizen 
cavalry! We we'll, we we'll want to make sure that this unit is broken completely first. Nice job. We know they are only broken. We need them to shatter. Uh, let's quickly pull these units together. The we'll pour much more Orders. devastating fire. The enemy general is dead. Nice. Not sure how though. As Okay, the outnumbered Hippias units needs help. Once we just charge once into this commercial unit. But the horse commercial is actually faring quite poorly against our men. So are the javelin men. Let's start tearing them down, guys. Commander, orders understood. Nice. They are slowly being rip ripped to shreds there. Okay, they're gonna get caught. Let's just engage. <laughs> Let's see how this turns out. Okay, let's get these guys not to fire. Should we kill at least one or two of them? Okay, let's get these guys to move aside while well, these two form up. As you command. Archers! Ready and waiting. Understood. Nice. Archers! Missile infantry. Come on. You have a clear shot now. At least take one of them out. Well, we took out one of our own guys as well. But we are s they're almost dead. And the last two guys hopefully will drop soon. We're having a lot of friendly fire though. What the hell are we doing? What the hell is this unit doing?
We probably maimed quite a lot of our own men. But it's okay. Slowly winning this battle. And this cap is also suffering under a missile barrage. And hopefully they'll go as well. Let's quickly form up differently. And maybe form out over here. Advance at speed. Citizen cavalry. The citizen calf is doing quite well. They must be able to walk properly now. Let's see, let's just aim a few volleys. And let's just get rid of our last rounds taking out the unit. Oh, they're actually attacking us. Oh dear. We will be able to drop them, but probably not quick enough. We'll probably try to deal them in crossfire. Oh, they're out of ammunition, oh dear. This is bad. Ready for orders. Let's see now. Let's crush this journey against those guys. Okay, let's organize these units. And let's get our remaining men to perform something of use. It's time to put the running to an end. This is all just waste time so that this unit can reach and we can pull the other two units out. Meantime, what units are there left? We'll send these guys against the broken men. As well as these.
let's try to save this unit. Oh, actually, these guys can just aim at the phalanx. That would help a lot if we just all line up like this. Okay. Archers. Now that these guys are mainly lined up, we can begin ripping these guys to shreds. Or at least hopefully. Ah yes, the volley begins. Let's see. What now? We'll draw these guys together. Probably on a rear charge. How much has the unit been dropped to? 220? We we'll probably want to pull some hoplites back. After all, attacking pikes in the head isn't exactly the best idea. Okay, let's see. First, let's get these guys together. Let's get this unit to form up over here. This unit is still engaging that unit. We're starting to break most of their units here. Most of their units are starting to go now. Let's just continue the battle a bit so you can continue on with a bit of slaughter. By your command. Citizen cavalry. And let our calf have a field day today. Citizen cavalry. Let's send this unit after these guys. Oh, actually, these the enemy guys. general is dead. No, 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 these guys, yes. They're much larger, larger group. That unit's probably a goner. Surely these guys have got something to chase. That unit. Keep on chasing. Okay. These guys can chase after those guys. And hopefully the pursuit of these men will end quickly. I used to remember the old Total War games, you can see the routing units, which helped a lot. Now you have to spot them with your own eye. I don't think there's any more that we can go for, so let's just end the battle here. It's a close victory, but a victory nevertheless. We end the turn deployed in our own fields. We had some serious friendly fire though. Our Kev did well, racking up 400 kills 
for two units and 200 kills on one unit our archers did splendidly again so their infantry how many people on their side survived uh less around 100 so that's great They've slaughtered most of them and hopefully next turn with a slightly replenished army we can just take them down I'll see you guys Okay, this may not be the campaign map you were expecting but long story Basically, I have realized that the entire recording of the previous turn after the battle the file has been corrupted and that sucks so what has happened is that uh, Bithynia has taken Iconium leaving Sardis as you can see kind of destroyed Trout Populous blah blah inspired Populous blah 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 Bithynia basically just took our efforts and gained the loot so we are now officially at peace again I'll probably keep this army yes. and the navy too For the gods! let's just quickly auto resolve this Sardis is now a nation without a city and they are slowly be removed from the map this uh, arrogant wife good because she is of the opposing faction let's put in a capable bureaucrat and let's put him as a political reformer because why not what does the reformer trait give him Minus one correction as well. That's nice. We we'll research. Uh, was it? Where was it? Philosophy. Yes. So now we can recruit dignitaries. And now we should research organized supply. We should only take our seven turns. Um. Let's see. Is this general of our faction? Let's check. Yes, he is of our faction. So let's... Let's get these guys to sail over here. Here. Stopping for now. These guys will sail over here As you command, And hopefully we can take out these guys to victory! And now oh, come on they sailed away Leave none alive. It is an We'll probably want both that armies to merge up soon And more importantly is, Are there any factions that you know kind of don't like us? Because they'll probably be our next victims. Macedon. They're allied with Athens. Uh, let's see. Hmm. That's actually a good point. Where do we expand to next? We can always try to go for Rome. Or perhaps the Tribali Or the Macedonians even Or perhaps we should go for the Bithynians But whatever it is we need a concerted military effort involving both of our armies
we could, you know, just go for Athens or Sparta. And just unify the Greek and uh, areas and connect our lands. They're defensively allied with Sparta and Egypt. And what about Sparta then? The allied with Macedon. Macedon's allied with Sparta and Athens. So if we're gonna take on one of them, we're probably just gonna have to take on the whole lot. And that we need armies. Lots of them. So let's start putting them into place. Let's move these guys into Ephesus. Ready for orders. Row, row, row. That's it. It is an honor to serve. We'll probably combine these two armies together and disband this general. And probably sail them up north and still or perhaps dock them at roads to recruit. Nice. Okay. We'll probably go for Peladen and the Macedonians. Our income's not very good now. Mainly because of the sheer size of our armed forces. I'm not sure, let's just sail into the unknown. And discover yet undiscovered factions. Oh yes, we can we should be able to recruit dignitaries now, right? Recruit agent. Dignitary, but we do not have enough money. Oh well, I'll see you guys next turn then.